An angler reeled in an unusual catch while fishing in the Allegheny. I'm increasingly concerned with the number of fish they're catching with deformations, cysts, and tumors. No, it's a bizarre looking creature. It's some amalgamation of all kinds of species shoved into one to make this crazy looking animal. It appears to show a carp with a face that looks disturbingly human. Deformity, mutation, or just a case of evolution gone wrong. There's a lot that goes on that remains unbelievable till it's discovered. Get ready to witness some of the most baffling abnormalities that at first seemed normal until it was seen closely. You got this. Look at that, they're like bug eyes. An angler in China reeled in a strangely peculiar fish. Or was it a pigeon? He was also shocked and confused, but later found out it was a mutated grass carp that had a normal body like a fish, but its head had a distinctive and mismatched shape that resembled a pigeon. As the video got the internet's attention, people were quick to come up with different speculations. Most of them said it could be a hybrid, but that didn't seem to be a plausible answer. Others thought it to be an undiscovered fish species. However, negating all those speculations, it was declared that it was just a mutated grass carp. Fish with two mouths. Moving on to another natural marvel, it's gonna leave your mouth agape, just like this fish. Only this fish has two mouths wide open. When the fish got caught in the hook, it left the fisherman taken aback by its bizarre appearance. And in no time, the two-mouthed fish became a celebrity with locals gathering around to catch its sight and the fisherman. Well, they were all equally flabbergasted. I mean, weren't it you too? Extreme mutation. Here's another fish that left the experts scratching their heads. The fishermen were fishing somewhere in central Russia when the bait worms caught this bizarre fish. And as he reeled it in, his mouth hung open as the fish was nowhere near a normal one. Its appearance was quite strange, the kind you may have never seen before. When the experts sat together to study this fish, some speculated it to be a mutated version of a Chinese sleeper. However, others negated it and said it could be a mutation of eel or some species of a piranha. However, its actual nature was never found out. Cyclops Shark This was the first ever of its kind found back in 2011, an albino shark fetus. But it wasn't just albino, it was a one-eyed shark too, a cyclops shark. It's a cyclops shark, it's an exceptional case because there have never been international reports, scientific reports, nothing of that sort about a shark that has these features. This was found in Mexico, in the Sea of Cortez, and the fishermen and scientists were more than thrilled about such a rare find, as this was the first to have been officially verified. The fishermen had found it in the mouth of a bigger shark in the net and immediately rescued it. However, he was also shocked that it was unlikely for the shark to survive with its rare abnormality, whereas the reason for its strange features was still unknown. In the trap was a big shark, and inside were her young. By the time we reached the shore, we had cut her up and found that inside was a shark with one eye. We'd never seen anything like that before. Three-legged sea monster. People were fishing near Coney Island when they reeled in a very strange sea creature, but they had no idea what it was. To find the answers, one of them turned to internet geniuses to find the answers and uploaded the video on TikTok. A bizarre video captured a live, scaly fish with a crocodile-like body squirming on a dock. But there was a twist. It survived out of water, revealing it as a three-legged reptile, defying aquatic norms. However, people on the internet had no answers either. They were all equally confused like the fishermen who found it were. Was it some mutated reptile? An undiscovered creature? Or what? Nothing could be said for sure. Eyeless alien fish. 
The world of unexplored marine life will have ways to leave you stunned. The creatures that lie beneath the depths are totally mind-boggling, and even leave the experts amazed. Here is another one of such incidents. This fisherman threw his net in the water to catch fish. All was good, the same routine. But when he pulled the net back, something caught his eye. Among all those fish, there was one that stood out the most. It had a huge mouth, and the fins and elongated body looked like a mix of an eel and a fish. Was it a hybrid or some rare mutation? Everyone had different opinions, but nothing could be said for sure. Mutant Somp Back in 2016, Jeremy Wade, who's a popular TV celebrity and host of River Monsters, decided to head to the Chernobyl River to catch a fish called the Black Somme. With the area being radioactive and the rumor of the Black Somme having bitten off a diver's hand, it made this fishing experience extraordinary. With not much fishing activity around, it wasn't long until he had something huge caught up on his bait. The giant black som, which was supposed to be twice its size considering its age, showed that the radioactive nature of the area had a stunted growth as a consequence. This Chernobyl catfish is under half the normal size for its age, its stunted flesh harboring 16 times the usual level of radiation. However, other features such as the long, dark, tapering body shape, wide head, slimy skin, tentacles, and worn down teeth were similar to that of its species. Barrow trauma in fish. I thought I would show you guys this. Look at that, they're like bug eyes. It was a normal, pleasant fishing day in the ocean. The same old fish reeling routine, until one of the catches that they made was different. The breed was fine. It was a grouper fish. But look closely and it won't go unnoticed. Its eyes were popping out of its sockets. It looked like the orbs had been glued over its face. Guys, look at this. This is a yellow edge, but look at his big old eyes. I thought I would show you guys this. However, it was not any mutation or rare species of grouper. It was just a sudden drop in ocean water pressure that caused its eyes to bulge out like that. Barotrauma happens to fish of the deep sea that thrive in stronger pressure. Otherwise, it can result in something like this. Three-eyed fish in the New York Canal. Back in 2016, this video surfaced on the internet and caused a stir among the masses. The guy had caught a fish in the Gowanus Canal in Brooklyn, and that left the people with different opinions. The reason? Well, the fish had three eyes. Where some people were stunned at the peculiar features, others doubted its authenticity, calling it phony. However, a three-eyed fish was also caught in Argentina near a nuclear power plant back in 2011, and that made the people rethink their contradictory claims, as the one at Gowanus can also be the result of some mutation. What do you think, though? Alien Fish This 19-year-old fisherman was on a hunt across the Norwegian island to find the very rare blue halibut. But what he found instead was way more extraordinary. He spotted this fish with bulbous eyes looking nothing near to real. He almost fell into the water in the struggle to reel in the strange huge fish. He was thrilled at this creature that he even forgot what he actually came to do. However, when his pictures spread around, people corrected him saying it was a rough head grenadier. Yeah, it does look like an alien because of the eyes, but in fact was not. Sucker Mouth Catfish. Hey! It was like this guy was starring in his own National Geographic show. He leapt into the water and came up with a big, rebellious fish. A Sucker Mouth Catfish. And well, it didn't look like the fish wanted to get caught as it was fidgeting to get out of the hold. This fish is notable for its appearance and the fact that it feeds on wood. You may have also noticed that fish is quite skittish, and not everyone's cup of tea to hold it. But this man also did it with quiet efficiency. He dove into the water, and there had it in his tight grip. Just look how he's showing off his great catch. Hey, look at me. 
mutated parrot Kitchlid. That thing is ridiculous! Look at the head on this sucker! You don't know what he's thinking about! Even hear These guys were on a playful parrot Kitchlid hunt in this river. And, well, they were quite lucky as this river was filled with plenty of them. Their excitement turned to ecstasy when this one got hooked. They carefully caught it with the help of a net. And that's when they noticed there was something odd about this little orange fish. It had a strange bump on its head. It was like its brain was popping out. And that thrilled the guys for this strange mutation. This one's probably a Look hybrid. A head. Dude, that thing's ready good, to make some beef. Good brain on this fella. This one was also caught in a bizarre condition, with its eyes popping out of its head. The Kitchlid was swimming fine and looked okay, but its appearance was telling a different story. It definitely had gone through an attack. Maybe a red-tailed catfish had shown its wrath, bit its head, which made its eyes pop out like that. All beat up, and what I think happened was a red tail just absolutely grabbed him and popped his eye. Bodiless fish. Now this is what you call resilience. In the Maldives, a diver spotted what seemed to be a fish that was mostly eaten, but despite that, it just seemed to defy all odds. I mean, this fish was only surviving with its head, and all of its body was probably eaten up by some predator. But that's not important. The highlight is, how on earth is it alive and still floating? But let me tell you a fun little fact. Fish can survive without their bodies for six months. What happens is, the vital organs of the fish, like the brain, respiratory organs, and spinal cord are present in its head. And with those organs intact, it can survive for a certain period of time. Fish with human teeth. This guy's fishing trip went crazy when he caught a fish in his net that defied beliefs. It was a pretty normal fish. The body shape and size were fine. The fins were okay. The color was okay. No eyes popping out. However, its teeth were... Well, they stood out the most, as they were sticking right out. But something was even more bizarre about this fish. The teeth were so not like you see in a regular fish. Instead, they were like human teeth, and they were really abnormally big for this fish. Scorpion fish. One of the poisonous, that's probably the most, oh, venom, the most venomous fish in Florida, dude, the scorpion fish. These guys' bottom fishing mission was going absolutely fine. They were catching some great fish, until they reeled in a fish that's one of a kind. As soon as it appeared on the surface, they knew it was something extraordinary, some rare species of fish. Yellowtail or an eel? Wait, is it a rockfish? The air was filled with different speculations and suggestions, until it came near and they reeled it up, and they found it was nothing they had thought. It was one of the most venomous of all sea creatures, a scorpion fish. Those fins were enough to intoxicate a man with just a single touch. Albino Dolphin Coast of Monterey Bay, a rare albino dolphin was spotted swimming alone and then with its pod of dark gray dolphins. The marine creatures will always have ways to leave you in awe, as this dolphin in Monterey Bay astonished the viewers and even made it to the headlines. The drone captured a pod of dolphins swimming off the coast, but there was something different. In the pod of gray dolphins, there was one white dolphin defying the odds. I mean, at least I never knew that dolphins could be albino too. And this, well, it definitely was one. Not just in Monterey Bay, albino dolphins have also been spotted in Laguna Beach, swimming with the gray dolphin pod. Apparently, these dolphins rarely come to the surface and have been seen only a few times. <laughs> right off of Laguna Beach, among them, this rare white Riso's dolphin. Unidentified fish. An ordinary day of fishing turned extraordinary when this guy's fishing rod reeled in a strange fish. He was looking out to hunt for normal fish until things took an unexpected turn and this sluggish fish was reeled in. It was huge in size and left him completely stunned but thrilled. From its fins to the patterns and sluggish body texture, it was later identified to be a snakehead fish. 
which is a very rare kind to find even within its habitat of the freshwater reservoirs of Africa and Asia. Jawless Gator This gator made headlines with its peculiar features. In September 2023, a resident of Florida found a juvenile alligator in a very bizarre condition, where its top jaw was missing. An alligator that's missing half of its jaw has now been trapped and rescued. It looked like the baby had been through an animal fight while staying in the wild, and definitely had suffered for a long time. However, the workers at Gatorland found it and thought no more. They took the poor gator to the Gatorland amusement park for a better home. I'm a little diva, but right now she's being very good, very down to earth, very humble at this point. It was being fed well and was getting treated by a doctor. They were hopeful that its chances of survival were much better now, and that also made it more active and feisty, showing that it would be all right soon and have no other health issues. Three-Headed Frog I can bet this will absolutely be an utterly staggering sight for you. No, they're not mating, nor are they glued together. But yes, they definitely were born and stuck together for life. These three-headed frogs were found by the wilderness on the outskirts of Winchester. It had three heads, and a spectacle that defied all explanations. From avid viewers to wildlife experts, everyone was baffled after its sighting back in 2004. However, it's not just the heads that are in odd numbers, but they had six legs, too. It looked as if they were complete frogs with just their bodies glued together, whereas it was unsure whether they eat with different mouths or with just one. Sunfish. What is that thing? On one particular day in 2020, 911 received multiple calls reporting the same incident. There's something out there swarming around. All I can get out of it is a fan or a flipper. While people were on a boating trip around the river, they spotted a weird fish writhing around in the water, which scared the life out of them. What is that thing, dude? Look at that thing! Oh my god! Their fun trip turned worrisome when this round fish started creating havoc in the water. People instantly reported the weird presence out of horror, and well, it turned out it wasn't even that big of a scare, as it was just a sunfish, a very docile giant, and posed no harm to humans, as it preys only on small fish and jellyfish. Sea pig. Sea pigs? Those look more like sea worms now, don't they? Sea pigs are the small, gummy, pig-like creatures that live on the ocean floor. Now, if you got the idea that they look like pigs, they don't really, as they have more legs than pigs do and, well, no eyes at all. Besides, they're completely translucent. But don't judge them by their appearance. Sea pigs deserve a lot of praise for how important they are for the ocean ecosystem. Even if they're very common, you won't see one in person as they live in the coldest and deepest part of the ocean, up to four miles below the surface. One-Eyed Goat so you've seen a cyclops shark, but I'd bet that this will blow your mind. This goat was born in India back in 2017 with a rare mutation, commonly known as cyclopia. In this condition, the orbits of the eyes fail to develop into two cavities, and such deformities also contour the animal's body, as you can see in this goat. According to experts, such types of conditions happen due to the high amounts of toxins present during fetal development, and it was speculated that the mother goat may have had some toxins in her diet while she was expecting. As such kinds of mutated animals don't live for too long, this one didn't either. Mutation in Lamb Meet a peculiar lamb from Russia a result of some strange twist of nature. Well, its face deformation makes it look human-like. Now, apart from its face, the legs of this little one also are too weak for standing, which also makes it handicapped, especially with its hind legs that were a bit too tiny. The deformation in this case was so severe that it left the owner, as well as anyone who saw it, quite surprised. Some experts believe that this might be the result of a parent having an overdose of vitamin A during pregnancy. 
a local circus made an expensive offer to the farmer for the lamb, who, after having developed a bond, decided to decline the offer. Piglet with Trunk If you thought it was an elephant baby, well, let me go ahead and burst your bubble. It's actually a pig. Well, with some bizarre, unpig-like features. This piglet was born in Nakhon Patong province in Thailand back in 2018, along with a tiny trunk hanging from its face, making it difficult for it to suckle its mother. If that wasn't enough of the misery, the piglet was blind too. This is treated as just another case of deformation, but according to a veterinarian, there is a good chance that this is the result of its mother drinking polluted water during pregnancy. However, the kind locals took it upon themselves to bottle feed the piglet as they took turns feeding it. Muntjac Deer Meet the Muntjac, the tiniest yet most extraordinary deer species. They're not just any deer, but the OGs of its species, dating back to a whopping 35 million years ago. Now, what sets them apart are the two standout orbital glands and a quirky forehead gland. They use these facial marvels to mark their territory by sniffing out scents. Watch closely. When a friendly human offers munchies to it, those glands spring into action, checking if it's a safe snack. And here's the gender twist. Males rock antlers, but females keep it sleek. Yet the real kicker about them is the natural chemist-like abilities that they behold, as they communicate via secret gland codes. Zombie Shark A fisherman spotted this shark in a bizarre state and decided to trail it. It looked like the shark had been through a fight very recently, as its half-eaten body had fresh injuries. It was still flabbergasting that, despite being injured that badly, it was still swimming around. But if you notice, the shark doesn't have an option, as its wounds were attracting other predators that are trailing behind it to make a feast out of the poor animal. And to answer how it's still alive, well, sharks are quite resilient and can survive with partial bodies for a certain period of time. Goblin Shark This goblin shark was caught off the coast of the Atlantic Ocean and it was one prized catch. These sharks are as scary as they sound. I mean, just take a look at this catch. Even when the shark is lying lifeless, the sense of its lethality in its jaws is enough to terrify anyone. Its teeth were pointy, unlike any other shark, as it rips its prey apart rather than thrashing it. It's not really a rare species of shark, but definitely a very scary one. The goblin sharks stay 300 to 900 meters down in the ocean and it's safe to call them the Deep Sea Monsters. Two-Headed Snake Here's a double trouble in the tale of serpents. If one venomous creature wasn't enough, this man hit the jackpot when he spotted a two-headed copperhead snake in his backyard. Just look how they were struggling to move when they both wanted to go different ways. Of course, they have different brains and different desires, but they share a heart and the same set of lungs. However, with time, they start to manage living in the same body to keep up with the coordination. One puts its head on the other to go in the same direction. Whereas if they both eat at the same time, it can end up choking, as the food will have to pass through the same path. Giant Fluorescent Bluefish While the group of fishermen was fishing in the river in Gaston County, North Carolina, a very strange sight caught their attention. There was a fluorescent bluefish swimming in the river. Its identity was unknown. Coloration in the fish was a mystery. Was it the result of some mutation or a new species? Nobody had the answer. Its four foot size and 30 pound weight made them speculate it to be a carp but its fluorescent blue color put that speculation to a blur as well, as this color was one in a million kind of feature. Some thought it to be a rainbow trout that turns to this color due to genetic variants, but that factor is also quite rare. Paralyzed Cub 
meet Junior. This cub ended up in the middle of a battle in the night, and the morning sun revealed the poor animal had become paralyzed in his hind legs. He had to drag himself around the forest to stay included in the pride. The cub may have been paralyzed, but it was still courageous and tried to stay self-sufficient. Due to his size, his mother couldn't even carry him in her mouth. He was completely on his own. However, his mother kept struggling to keep him in the pride, as the lions tend to abandon the weaker ones. His family nuzzles him to encourage him with love, as there's still a long journey to reach north. Amputated Monkey Here is a disabled monkey who proved she is nowhere near miserable. With its amputated hands, she's learned to survive and do all the work with no issues. Look how she jumped up the ledge like a pro! She uses her feet to eat and does it really efficiently. If you're still not convinced of her extraordinary abilities, look how she's carrying a baby in her hands and drinking water at the same time. It looked like this animal had perfectly adjusted to her condition because there was nothing that looked hard for her. Climbing trees, carrying babies, eating? She does everything like normal monkeys do, beating all the odds of living without hands. Three-Legged Lion This king here is in great misery. Its one leg is gone, and there is no one to blame for it except for the crocodile. It's all normal when the predators of a safari hunt. Lions chasing deers, crocodiles charging at Arabian oryx, and other prey. It's the wild routine of wildlife. But it all gets even wilder when the two predators come face to face. This lion couple started the fight as they were trying to get a hold of the lone croc, but the reptile was not an easy hunt. It started using its sharp teeth for a counter strike and kept the predator couple at a distance. But then the fight got intense, and that's how the poor lion lost one of its legs. It staggers its way around the safari nowadays. Leafy Sea Dragon this floating, leafy creature is not just ocean plants, but it is a creature. A very attractive one with peculiar features. Divers came across this, and at first they thought it to be a plant or a mutated seahorse. But after researching over this ocean beauty, they found out that indeed, mutation can't be this good looking. It was a leafy sea dragon. Its appearance resembled a seahorse, while its limbs are like delicate branches of a plant. It was moving with such elegance that its leaves were swaying in the water, creating exquisite beauty. And don't you think this wondrous creature totally changed the mood of our video? Muscular Bull Doesn't it look like this bull is here to win a WWE trophy? Some close relative to Brock Lesnar, maybe. I mean, just look at those muscles. With every step, every muscle pack on this bull's body moves separately, making its body contours even more prominent. This Belgian bull made the headlines with its huge size after a Twitter account posted this video. The bull was born with the absence of myostatin that restricts muscle growth, and as a result, this beast came into existence. This absence of myostatin in the bull is caused by a mutation that prevents myostatin from doing its thing. It may look like a WWE champion, but it was just a mutated Belgian bull. Unique Zebra If there was such a thing as negatives when it comes to zebras or their stripes, this is the real-life embodiment of it. No, it was not any different breed, it was a part of them, just with a slightly different appearance. Its name is Tira, and it has been seen in different parts of the world along with its mother, who never leaves it alone. Tira was first spotted crossing Tanzania in 2019, and then it vanished, and it was thought it had passed away. But then, after two years, it was seen again in Maasai Mara with a big herd. It was good that the zebras were keeping Tira with them, and didn't abandon it for being the odd one among the group. Tegu Lizard. Now, that's not an alligator, crocodile, or a caiman. This reptile was found on the road in Beaumont and almost got hit by a car. 
The driver at first thought it to be an odd-looking cat, which he decided to get closer to to investigate what it actually was. He knew it didn't belong there and took the lizard to the authorities for its own safety. I started trying to pet its tail, and I saw that it didn't try to bite me or anything, then I finally just picked it up. This local of Central and South America was definitely on the loose, but was taken back to its home shortly after the man rescued it. However, with its scaly body and neck, it did look like a relative to the gators or crocs, but it's more of a monitor lizard family. Open Discussion in April 2023, a man with 6.7 million followers took to Instagram and uploaded a picture of a man holding a giant, bizarre-looking fish. He claimed it to be an Algerian gorilla fish. The creature had a big gorilla-like face, while its body resembled a hairy seal. The fish was caught by a man in central Trinidad and was making rounds around social media. However, most people were not convinced that it was an actual sea creature and called it fake. However, the man who caught it was adamant that it was indeed real. He even posted all the details about this weird fish that turns red when it has to attract females, gives up to 34 eggs, and can live from 13 to 48 years. Internet wizards called the information all fictitious and were not real at all. But we'll leave it up to you to decide whether it's a real creature from one of the mysteries laying in the deep sea or just an absolute fake. Comment down your thoughts below. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.